And we are now at the end of summer 2024. Uh, sadly, some of you are already back in school. Many of you are going back to school in the next eight to 10 days. And so I wanna get into my fall class schedule. I have a number of announcements to make, including the dawn of a new era. We'll get to that in a moment. Uh, all times on this are gonna be Pacific when I get to that. I just wanted to make sure you knew about several things. There is a new student discount for all of these things on here. If you mention this video, you'll get 20% off your first month of classes. Um, there is a current student discount for this class, which was a huge hit last year. It was three hours last year. This year, this year it's four. And if you wanna know what the small notebook class is, I'll get to that in a moment and talk about it. I have a new email as well. But before we get to all of that, do you notice something different, maybe a little, a little different? Like something missing? Like, like maybe a microphone cord is gone. It's gone, it's not here, it doesn't. All of my videos from the very beginning have all been using an XLR mic plugged in through my sound box and it had a little cord attached to it. And it kind of hung down here and was like, hey, I got this cool, not so cool cord. And so uh, earlier this year, was talking with a good friend and they were looking at my content and uh, they made a suggestion. They were hesitant to share it because people, you know, they don't want to critique, but actually it's very helpful. And this was a very helpful offering of a suggestion. And they suggested, hey, maybe you should use a microphone that doesn't have a cord, like a wireless mic, because I think it would look better. And they were exactly right. And so I went ahead and did a bunch of research to find the best one for me. And this is the one that I chose, and I hope you like it. It's got a little poofy thing on it, which is kind of cool, because it's just, I don't, poofy stuff is cool, right? I think, something like that. But anyhow, uh, leave me a comment down below. Let me know if you can hear the sound okay. To be honest, I've been fiddling with the setup of this mic for the last four hours. <laughs> and this is about the sixth or seventh or eighth or ninth video I filmed of this video. And so uh, hopefully, hopefully the sound is working good this time. And I'm excited, this is a new era for me, and hopefully it goes well from all future videos going forward. Um, let's get to the class schedule. By the way, there is a risk-free trial. What does that mean? If you're a new student, you've never tried my classes, um, you get to sit in on it before you decide. You can take the class, sit in on one session, and say, you know, I loved it, I wanna join. Or, you know what, I didn't like it, which is okay. What I'm here is to help you. If I can help you, if I'm the teacher to do that, great. If you can sit in on a class and decide it's not for you, that's great also. What I want is the best thing for you. And that's why I offer the risk-free trial. You can sit in, decide for yourself if I am the teaching style that matches with your learning style or I'm not. In the three to four years since I launched my own company, I've had about 250 to 300 students sit in on a class and only about two, maybe three did not take the class. So it's pretty high success rate. That's also why I offer it. I'm very confident that you will enjoy the class. Uh, there is nobody who goes through the AOPS books more thoroughly than I do. You will understand everything in the text as long as you participate to the fullest. I can't make you do the homework and things like that, but as long as you take it upon yourself to do so, there is no more thorough coverage than what I do. Okay, so uh, there's also, if you're a new student, 20% off your first month of classes, first four weeks, and you can just mention this video and you will get that discount. If you're a current student, what is the small notebook class? Huge hit last year, like I said, 60 to 80 students took the class, and if you look, it's going to be various concepts formulas, ideas that I've written in mine. Like this says perfect squares have an odd number of positive divisors. They're in fact the only numbers that have an odd number of positive divisors. So if the test says, you know, integer n has an odd number of divisors, you go, oh, it's a perfect square. That's how that works. It's a bunch of concepts like that that I've recorded in my small notebook over the last 15 years from my teaching times and my studying times. And so I encourage all students to keep their own small notebook with the concepts, ideas, formulas, thoughts, mistakes to be careful of, all those things on their own as well. You can see a video, I will link it in the description down below that will tell you more about the small notebook and how you can utilize it to its best effect. In my opinion, it's best handwritten, not typed. You'll get more out of it and you'll understand the concepts better when you write them down 
by hand. Okay, so all my current students, when you've taken classes with me throughout the last year, there is a 40% discount on this class. So I'm having the first one Sunday, September 8th. Last year, it was split between AMC 10 and 12 in a three hour nonstop fast paced lecture and it took a lot out of me and burned out my voice. So this year, what I'm doing is a two hours, one hour break, two hours split. I've added about 20 more concepts since last year that weren't in there. And so if you would like to get in on the first of the 2024 edition, this would be the class for that. Reach out to either my new email, math.coach at thebeautyofmath.net. By the way, if you send me a message on my website and you don't see a response within a week, check your spam folders. Sometimes for whatever reason, it gets filtered to spam. I don't email anyone spam ever. I don't send stuff out like that. So somehow it's just whatever AI filtration or some garbage, some such things that you might have put in your filtration or that Gmail did. And sometimes it goes there, but it's not that I didn't respond. So be sure to check the other folders to make sure it wasn't filtered out. Also, if your class that you'd like to do is not listed up here, I do all of these other subjects as well. I have um, any school math that you want. You want AP Pre-Cal, Geo, SAT Prep, all of those things I do upon request. I'm, an, I'm the only person that works for me. I don't have other te teachers. I don't have enough students for other teachers at this time either. But as a result, I can't just launch a class and then hope people join. I have to wait till it comes by request. And when I get three students or families who have requested a class, I will form it. And so I apologize that I'm not a huge, you know, multi-million dollar company that can afford to just make the schedule and a bunch of people will join it. I'm a much smaller outfit than that. So I want to get to the schedule I have up here. I have Sundays, 6 to 7.30 p.m., intro to number theory. Uh, this class is only about halfway through the course. We have not gotten to modular arithmetic, for example. So if you have the first half of the book done from AOPS, which is the book that I use, and you'd like to get help going through the second half, feel free to reach out to me to join this class. Mondays is AMC 12, Tuesdays is AMC 10. These courses use one pass test per week for an hour and a half, and I go through and break down strategies and content, when to skip, you know, what should I be thinking of at this point? How fast should I get through the first 10? Which problems are kind of one-off ideas and which are pattern, things like that. And I try to point out small notebook concepts as we go through, since all of my students do keep a small notebook as they go, and that way you can add to yours directly from the class. Okay, and so these classes are, have been going on since December. You either can leave and join at will. It's not like a require that you stay in the class. And uh, they're already in the 2019 contests. We do one test a week, like I said. So if you'd like to go back to say 2010 to present day, request it. I'll form a two hour class if I get at least three students who would like that course. I do, by the way, have two students interested in the AIME prep, um, but it's not quite ready to launch yet. I need at least one more student before I can do so. Then what? Uh, Thursdays is intro to counting and probability. I don't have a class on Wednesday. Why? Because I'm a human being and I like to have at least one day off a week so that I too can get some rest and not go nuts. <laughs> it gets really challenging to never have a day off and I've done that for the past 15 years. <laughs> Where like the four or five month period running up to the contest, I just don't take days off and it burns out the teacher as well. And so it makes it really difficult. So I'm trying not to add people on this day. I do occasionally have private tutor students on it, but some allowances must be made because of scheduling. So uh, Thursday, five to 6.30, intro to counting and probability is already in the latter half of the book. Um, we have about three chapters to go. So I wouldn't recommend joining that this late in the game. But Friday's class, AMC 8 Math Counts, if you're planning to take those contests next year, if you're in middle school, I will be adding a lot more students to this class. Currently, it only has a handful. It will max out at 12 students. So if you're interested in that, join now. When we get to September, October, I will be adding other content besides past tests like a speed module. How do I go quickly through problems? What are calculation techniques that I can practice to go quicker than my peers. And so if you'd like to join now, when we get to that part of it, I will take an entire session to go through speed calculations. Saturday is the 4 to 6 p.m. AMC Fundamentals course. 
This class is already discounted by about 40%. It is $35 for two hours. The textbook that we use is volume one. Uh, you will need your own copy of the textbook. Uh, PDF copies are not provided. Do not ask for them in my Discord server either. I don't agree with pirating. Um, uh, I have my own copy and you should have your own copy as well to support the people who wrote these books. So that's it. That's all I've got for you. Uh, do let me know how you like the new mic. I'm really excited to get this off the ground and uh, get started in this year's competition prep season. So hope you had a great summer. Hope you have a good start to your school year. I'll hear from you soon.